We had it on Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> it was a little chaotic. A lot of people grabbing things. We generally like hot pot a lot. You're in charge of what you can eat and it's a very communal experience. Where does hot pot originate from? I think maybe from the Sichuan region. You stole me. <laughs> known to be like incredibly spicy, very sweaty. You gotta like stick tissues under the arms. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> this is awesome. Yeah, it's, the, it's all for us. Look at this! Oh, sweet! <laughs> <laughs> oh, sesame paste. Taste my sauce. Mm. I like it. Cheese tofu. What? Delicious. Apparently it's incredibly rude to stab things with chopsticks. <laughs> so I'm not gonna do that. You're supposed to put the noodles in at the very end because by the time the hot pot is cooked down, it's at its most flavorful. So you should put the things that don't have as much flavor in last. Enoki mushrooms. Enoki mushrooms? They're the noodles of the mushroom world. Mm. <laughs> I think hot pot is like an awesome like, thing to do with a friend. If you get a little sake, a little, mm, some beers, because you can sort of sit around and chat and like scoop things out yep. and you can sort of take your time with mm. it too. Yeah, and it breaks, like it breaks the ice real quick mm. if you have to <laughs> slurp something down in front of people. It's really good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna push it over. Have you tasted this one? The, the sour plum? Yeah, taste Let me it. Try it's the sour so plum. good. Very refreshing. <laughs> it's so good. Yeah. I think this is really relaxing. Um, when you're at a hot pot restaurant, you have to sort of jump up and down and run around and fight people for things. And often there's like not enough of things. And so this is sort of like, mm -hmm. we can sit down and have a conversation mm -hmm. and also eat delicious hot pot. This, this meat looks way like fresher than anything I've ever seen in a bar restaurant. <laughs> yeah, that was one thing when I go to the restaurant. I never need, really know to, what to do. But here you can really um, experiment. I can see like this being such a good way to sort of have like a stress-free um, like dinner with friends. Mm -hmm. That this you could just order it and it would be there and you don't have to like run around in the kitchen it's just all done there's plenty of like vegetarian options which yeah, is awesome it's really good and you can kind of like control the experience i'm already planning my like next dinner party oh yes it's <laughs> my birthday is coming up i don't want to stop eating ever again <laughs> impressive oh. Now they can soak up all the flavor. This is like <laughs> next level of food experience at home, I think. So we've got some little nudes in here. Tasty. Mm. The noodles are like the perfect chewiness. I don't think I've ever had noodles as good. No, at like a hot pot restaurant. restaurant. These are like out of this world good. Mm -hmm. This is like perfectly umami and like save like deliciously savory. I love that someone has curated this for me and like chosen all these tasty things that I might have would have overlooked. Delicious! Tastes like boba tea. I really loved the hot pot. Mm -hmm. It was so tasty. Um probably the best hot pot I've ever had. What do you say? Mm, 10 out of 10. Yeah. Best one I ever had too. And um, it was also approachable and comfortable and Easy. homey. I loved it. It's so good. Yeah. I think it is like a really great way to like bring people together. <laughs> it's really nice. This one is so good. I like the chunks. Yeah, they're really good. The chunks are the winner for me. Love a good chunk.